Okay, hello internet. How is everybody? Um, thought I'd make a quick video. I've got a couple of these Kong slides, lanyard adjusters in the post the other day. I'm just going to set it up and go and try it out in the slate this afternoon. Looking around the internet, there's not a heap of useful information about how to set these up, so hopefully you'll find this useful. I recommend 9 to 10 millimeter dynamic rope. So I've um, been down to V12, picked up uh, a few meters of this 9.1 millimeter joker. Uh, thanks Will for that. Um, just gonna have a go at setting it up. Get some of this out of the way. Angle on that. The one on its own at the top there, that's gonna be going to the anchor. I'm going to thread this by going up through the big long hole first. That rope's thread's going to be at the top. Down through the little hole on the right on its own. Back out through the bottom there. Does that make sense? Yeah. And that's locking nicely. So, to work out how much rope I'm going to want, I'm going to put all my all my knots into the rope, uh, adjust it so that it is within reach, and then do the cut. So that knot there at the end of the line, this is going to be like a permanent knot in this rope, so that's always going to be in there really tight. Okay, so now I need to work out how much rope I need to allow for it to be within reach, but also enough for me to tie in. Great, so that's going to be my tying point, to my honest. And that's nicely within, within reach. This then is the point where I'm going to cut the rope. There we go. Wow, yep, that is stinky. Gross. So we got these nice melted ends of rope. So that's how I've set it up. And at the end of this rope, at the moment is just nothing. So when I use this um, this afternoon, I'm just going to tie in with a normal re-threaded figure of eight or bowline, I guess. Probably a re-threaded figure of eight. Best practice, maybe. Is it? What do you think? A little close up of that. So we've got stop and up, and that means if it does slide or you kind of adjust it really quickly, the the tail end of the rope can't unravel through the slide. So this bean is going to the anchor and this is going to be tied into my harness. Nice. Just to tie it into my harness to kind of show you that, make sure the length's okay. So single rope, 9.1, just over two meters of rope, stopping up, Kong slide, uh, and there's my uh, twist lock bean in there for Clipping into my anchors. Lovely, let's go climbing. <laughs> 